What's up everybody? Today I'm going to do a video showing you how I prepare my hair for my bossy wigs. And this one is actually going to be preparing my hair for a double part bossy wig. And so what I have now, I actually just took my braids out and detangled my hair um, from my last set of braids, from my last wig. So it's just in some twist right now. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to be applying a treatment to my scalp to help loosen up the hair. And the treatment that I'm going to be applying is the follicle food scalp treatment by Lux Therapy. I actually love the way this feels on my scalp. So the first thing I'm going to do is apply this to my scalp and then I'm going to use the Lux Therapy Scalp Soother to work it in and help loosen the dirt. Just really quick before I get started, I'll tell you a little bit more about the Lux Therapy Scalp Soother, which has four teeth on it. And you can see they're curved. Slide that up in there really quick while I tell you about it. So, um, it relieves itching under your hair and wigs because you know you get your scratch on. Ooh, that feels good. Increases blood circulation to the scalp. Gently lift scalp residue prior to shampooing, which is what we're about to do now. And the special curved design will not damage your scalp. As you can see, it sits flush on my scalp because it's curved and it fits the curvature of my head instead of being straight and sticking in or poking. So, I mean, I literally can't feel it while it's in my head right now. And also, it's recommended if you're using this after getting your hair braided for a sew-in or whatever else you're using it for, it's recommended that you allow seven days after your new install to enjoy your scalp soother. And um, just... When I got it, I got it with this. She has some celebrity juice in this product, y'all. Look at that. She got Lisa Ray, Kim Coles. Hey. Okay. The only thing I will recommend with this, after you use it, wash it. Because when you're doing all the scratching, of course you're going to get some dirt buildup on there. You don't want to put it back in the next time. You know, I don't mean you have to wash it every single time, but make sure you keep it clean. So, first thing we're going to do is use the follicle food scalp treatment, which is a great treatment. It has some really awesome ingredients in it. And I'll encourage you to go to the website to read more about this product. I don't want to get into too much detail. But the first thing we're going to do is just take the follicle food. I'm applying little drops to my scalp. Okay. Because it's going to also, it's going to help me uh, get my scalp a little wet so that the dirt will loosen up easier. But it's also going to nourish at the same time. And I just dig in there and squeeze. I don't squeeze too hard because I don't want it to come gushing out. But I squeeze enough so that it actually comes out. So I'm going to go through and do my whole head. Probably going to fast forward so you don't have to sit here and watch this because I have a big old dome. I'm just making sure that I get all of my scalp I'm going into the parts and also I'm going in between and you also want to make sure you get it around your hairline and on your edges because it's great for stimulating the circulation around your edges as well so I've done my whole head you see how much I've used doing my whole head and I used more than I probably should have just because my hair is extremely thick in the roots right now so not very much I'm just gonna take my scalp soother <laughs> and I'm gonna go in and just massage it a little bit making sure you know I get a little I'm gentle around my hairline really gentle but I'm still gonna massage it and you can use it like I said as a scalp massager rather than just a scratcher for people that do scalp massage okay. but making sure that I get every area really good and it's turning as I loosen it all up. So I'm going to just massage through my whole head making sure not to to massage too hard and I want to concentrate in the areas where I know I have a lot more buildup or it's harder for me to get to which would be the middle and the back of my head and I just make sure I angle the scalp soother in the middle to ensure that I get that area really good. Woo! Okay, so my scalp actually feels really good right now. It's 
a little tingly from using the treatment and that's because it does make you tingle a little bit and here's my soother as you can see I mean like I told you before there's a little dirt on there and the oils of course for my scalp so I'm gonna make sure I wash this before I use it again just because I use it on very dirty hair that I'm about to wash so I'm actually ooh, my scalp feels warm <laughs> um, I'm actually going to let this sit on my scalp for a while. I'm going to go work out really quick because I know that's also going to help the scalp treatment penetrate. I'm going to come back and I'm going to do one after I work out before I wash my hair. I'm going to do one more quick session with the scalp soother to loosen things up a little more. So I want to make sure my scalp is really clean because I've been wearing it in braids for a while. So I'm back from working out and I'm just going to take off my Save Your Do wrap. And I'm going to go ahead and take the Lux Therapy Scalp Scoot Soother and go back into my head. And now my, my scalp is really heated up and my blood is flowing, circulating. So I'm going in and I'm massaging lightly again all through my head. I'm going to do my hairline lightly around the front and the back. When I finish going through my whole head, now on to the rest of the prep for pre-shampoo. I'm going to go ahead and just take these twists down. And then I'm going to separate my hair into four sections. I'm going to finger comb a little bit, but my main goal is to separate into four sections so that I can wash my hair in my sections. As I separate them, I'm going to go ahead and just twist each section. Once your hair is separated into four sections, or you can do as many sections as you like, that is when I go ahead and hop on in the shower and do my shampoo. After your hair is all shampooed, then you can continue on with styling as you please. I will be blow drying and braiding so that I can put on my double part bossy wig. Hopefully this video was helpful and I will be back soon with some more videos on braid patterns. And I will talk to you later. Bye.